The ACLU was founded by a very unlikely coalition of progressives, Democrats, Republicans, socialists, communists, Helen Keller being one prominent example, feminists, pacifists, social workers, lawyers, etc. Some of them believed that more government intervention was the most promising source of protection of liberty. Others believed that government was the greatest threat to liberty. But despite their differences, the ACLU founders, men and women alike, all agreed on the principle that everybody should have the same right to liberty and justice. Despite what especially a number of our new members think, we are not an anti-Donald Trump organization. We oppose many of the Trump administration's policies, but we are nonpartisan, and our mission is to focus not on what elected officials we support or oppose, but on what policies we support or oppose because of their impact on civil liberties. We also sued President Obama at times. We sued President Clinton. In fact, I am proud to say that I believe that the ACLU has sued every president since we were founded in 1920. Civil liberties is bigger than whether you like or don't like Donald Trump. And we want people to be thinking about the difference between the political results they'd like to achieve and the fundamental values that I think need to remain above politics.